All right, so I'm picking up this four bottom plow for the Branson, and the reason I bought it is because of this trip mechanism. So how does this work, Craig? All right, when this point hits something solid that doesn't give, okay. there's a, a, a spring in here, I think it's a spring. This puts enough pressure on it, it springs it up, trips it up, and it'll stop like that. You just back up, and it'll snap into place, and you, go, you, you don't okay. have to have a tractor or nothing. And then the backup to that is the hole down there for yes, a shear pin? Yes, it's full of dirt, but this is a shear pin. Just So if it happens to hit something solid and this mechanism happens to wear out or break for some reason inside a little point, you put a shear pin through here, and then it'll break the shear pin. Then you just replace the shear pin. All right, nice. And we never really had any problems after we put shear pins in them. I mean, every once in a while you break one. But... All right, I got the four bottom plow to add to the collection. Uh, my hope is this winter, if we get a nice spell of weather, or in the spring, I'll turn over some of these plots. Get some of that hard pack to mix in with the uh, vegetation and dirt on top, and hopefully improve the long-term health of some of our plots and fields here. All right, so I got the plow in its new home for now, but look at this, man. I made some ruts here. And them R4 tires are aggressive. I'm sorry, the ag tires. I think I'm really going to have to work to get Megatron stuck, I'll tell you that. I mean, I haven't even had to click it in four-wheel drive yet, really. I mean, I, I've had it in it just to be safe, but I have not needed it yet. Don't worry, at some point I'll test it. There's a little better look at the track. Ground's just a little bit soft. Wait for winter time. Looking forward to getting it in some deep mud.